Hey friends, welcome back to my channel, Life as Tiff Knows It. Tiff here bringing you an unboxing from Diamond Art Club. Yay! This is a gift for my birthday from my mom. I'm so excited. And it is a... You know what? I just realized in my other one, I didn't even say the name of the diamond painting kit. How funny is that? Um, this is called um, Haimiji Castle by Sean Pitt. Pavone. It's really because it's just small text. <laughs> um, it is, it's a beautiful image. I'm really excited to get into this. It is going to definitely be a landscape that goes this way for sure. It is a round uh, diamond painting kit. And yes, I'm very, very excited. On the back, it does have some instructions how it works. All of the things, all of the hazards, helpful to know. Uh, I love the, there's a little sparkle on the actual box that you most likely cannot see. So why don't we go ahead and get into this kit. I'm so excited. Um, hopefully you're doing well. It's most likely getting closer to Christmas when you are watching this versus when I'm filming this. I took advantage of some time I have today because I'm currently on a break from work and thought I need to film all of these. So, gosh, it's hard to get into this plastic wrap. I haven't had this issue. Um, I did with the other one. They are like making sure that their product is wrapped very well, <laughs> which is not a bad thing. Wish I had some scissors handy. You know what I do have? Ha ha ha. I have my, um, my cut, my, uh, razor blade, if you will, to do the sectioning of diamond painting. So look, look at that. Ooh, sorry about that noise. Some people really do not like that noise. That kind of hurt my teeth. I have this weird thing where certain noises make me feel like it's chalk on chalkboard and it hurts my teeth random facts about me i guess okay so we finally opened up the plastic wrap let's get in here let's see what we got okay might as well start with this toolkit so every diamond art painting toolkit looks slightly different oh i forgot also the last one the cover binder oh my gosh so many things I did not do in my last unboxing. Oh, well. So we got in here. Ooh, again, this is very similar to my other one that I just got. Um, some washi tape that has really cute floral on it. That's going to go so well with this diamond painting. With a maroon squishy and then, of course, your heart um, wax. Oh, and look. Look at the color of this pen. That's kind of cool. It's also maroon or dark brown, brownish. And then bags. What I did not pull out the last time is the multi-placers. So I think this is a six placer, maybe seven, and this is four. It does kind of say on here four and seven. Okay. It's been a while, hot minute since I've opened up one of these. So we got multi-placers. Extra baggies, definitely going to take those to work because I can use them for another purpose. And this cute little dolphin cover minder. How cute is that? I like that. It's sparkly. So that is your toolkit that comes with this, this particular kit. It's different for each one. Uh, the colors and the cover minder vary. So let me get that out of the way. Let's go ahead and just get into... The diamond painting itself. This one I think is going to be a big one. Don't remember the dimensions. Oh, there's something else floating in here. Oh, the sticker. Look how pretty it is. I love it. Oh my gosh, it's going to be gorgeous. Gorgeous. So good. All right. I mentioned this in my last one. I love that Diamond Art Club. Um... They just put their branding very nicely on things. Looks nice to me. 
Let's get this plastic off to never be seen again. I have like a whole bag of plastic from the diamond paintings that I'm placing on the side here. Whoop, look at that. They're all coming out and I'm knocking the camera around. So, let's see. Oops. Is it going to fit in frame? That is the question. Ooh, it's big. This is a big one. Whoa. Um, really pretty colors here. We'll get into the drills. Just a reminder, anytime you purchase Diamond Art Club, it does have a coupon code. Thank you, 10, inside of it. It does also have the sticker with the start date. So we can see that the size here for this particular kit is 32.7 by 21.7. Uh, almost said feet. Holy crap, that would be big. Uh, inches or 83 centimeters by 55 centimeters. It does have 42 colors. It looks like it has three ABs. I can tell because ABs are typically under the number 150. If you didn't know that and let's go ahead and straighten this this lovely diamond painting out I was they've definitely changed the backing of their diamond paintings it's less fuzzy unless I just can't remember maybe I'm just less sensitive to the back of them I don't really like velvety type feels to things so it feels less velvety to me, and I am absolutely a fan of that. One thing, too, that I'm, I'm reminded of is there's a slight shimmer to these canvases on the front. Like, I really do think that's really pretty. But on the actual drill field, it does have, like, a little sparkle, which totally plays into this do what makes you sparkle. Okay, well, it's still curling a little bit, but I think we get... The effect here it's almost in frame if you can see oh man it's you can't there's like maybe an inch you cannot see at the bottom here but I think this is such a really pretty image there's like a lake here and look at these beautiful trees like this would be a really nice kit to do in the spring like that's maybe oh I just have so many plans for diamond painting and not enough time to do them but this is such a beautiful beautiful kit when we look at the canvas i would say that this does have more confetti than color blocking like lots of color blocking here color blocking within here um in the sky definitely but these trees definitely are going to have a lot of color changes color blocking just um means that it's the same symbol and confetti means that you're switching up your symbol a lot. Confetti takes a lot longer because you can't multi-place as much, but it's, oh my gosh, it's so good. I love it. It's gonna be so worth it. With three ABs, it's gonna be beautiful. Stop curling though. Would you stop curling, please? Please stop curling. That would be nice of you. That's okay. So let's go ahead and just look at the drills. So holy cow lots of drills here to be expected and try really hard to keep this bag intact so that I can just put them in there again for when I'm ready to uh, embrace this beautiful kit oh look at all of these oh my gosh gorgeous 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 I love it okay so when we're looking at colors and I recognize my camera is not really picking up the colors too terribly well in this light. So hopefully you can see them. But we got, um, I'm not going to say all the numbers. But lots of different brown shades of brown. Like this coffee brown. That's really nice. I like that. Here's our first AB right off the bat. It is a peach colored AB. I believe I have that in the last kit I unboxed too. A really dark rich brown. Two bags of that. Um, light blue, 3371, which looks to me in this light, it's such a dark brown, it looks black. And then a lighter brown, it almost is like a mix, oh, there's a green one in there, how random, 
um, between like a brown and a purple. So cute. so beautiful these colors. Nine three eight, which is pretty common in kits. Here's a very white color. Got lots of browns. That must be, of course, the um, branches to the trees. Oh my gosh, I really like this color right here. And then some light pinks. Lots and lots of light pinks. Oh my gosh. This makes me miss spring because the tree right outside where I'm filming is a um, cherry blossom tree, or it looks like it. So here's where the colors really pop in different ways. Like those are such beautiful, vibrant shades of colors, but we got like a variety here. So let's start like this way. Here's our other AB. Very few of these. So this um, 137 is this really pretty um, blue AB. 820. Look, an AB is in here. <laughs> That's funny. Lots of them got stuck where they don't go. I really like this like in between green and yellow. These are the ones that are just not going to be lots of, like these are accent colors for sure. Um, I'm wondering where these vibrant greens will go. It must be in like the trees over here, right over here. And let's see. Yeah, just lots of random shades of different colors here. And then here's our last AB. That is 134, and it is a really pretty shade of green. So, oh, it's going to be gorgeous. I'm trying to see. Some people really like to map out where the ABs on the kit are. So, the AB symbols for the three is 1, 2, and V. So, right away, I see lots of twos here. So, that green AB is going to be very much the focal point in the middle of the painting. And then let's see if I can find any ones. One was that one that had like none in them. Where are you ones? I cannot find, oh, here's a one. Ones are gonna be in this area here. And then V, 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 V. It's not popping out at me right now. I hope my head's not in the way. I could totally say hi. Hello. <laughs> um, but yeah, what a beautiful kit this is. This is going to be, I'm going to be really happy when I'm starting to work on this. It's going to look beautiful when it's done. Um, if you've been following my channel, you might know that I had a kind of similar diamond painting to this. I'm trying to actually replicate because it wasn't licensed and it was not a good experience. But this kit is going to be beautiful. I know it will be a good experience because Diamond Art Club has not disappointed me yet. So this will not be the time they, it disappoints me. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't already done so, please consider subscribing. I do release a lot of diamond painting content, probably with some knitting content as well at this point when you are seeing this. I appreciate your support. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.